How we doing? Good. Good. All right. Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, practice the books. So uh, one step closer to getting ready for our uh, matchup down in New Orleans. Um, obviously, we talked on uh, Tuesday just about uh, you know what we're up against. You know, very solid football team. So uh, we've had a solid week of practice. I've got to put our finishing touches on for the next couple of days before we head down there Friday afternoon. So questions. With Pratt coming back for them, that's a, another mobile quarterback, but a different type of mobile, I guess, again. I mean, he's much like ours in that, you know, extremely experienced. I mean, he's he's been a starter for three years now and, uh, you know, ton of experience. He's seen every look imaginable, great operator. Uh, so just further add to the challenge that we have. The older guys, they've gone against Tulane a number of times. Do you get the sense they have a feel for how important this game is and how, you know, the type of style they play with. They know exactly what they're up against. I mean, I, I think they respect uh, Coach Fritz and the job that his staff has done there just as much as I do. How has uh, Camaro Edmonds been this week in practice, maybe getting more reps? Excited. I mean, he's uh, he's anxious, you know, looking forward to, you know, getting some uh, getting some time. And, you know, uh, Coach Foster's done a good job of pushing him this week, and I think he's stepped up uh, his performance, so. Kind of in the same in the same vibe, Marlon Gunn, his kind of first week as, as the top dog. Well, he's not the top dog, but he's well. one of the dogs. Okay, um, but uh, I'm telling you, he's uh, I've been thoroughly impressed with him. Not just this week, but I mean, this has been something that's been building. Uh, he does a uh, he does a great job at practice. His work ethic, and the way he competes. Um, I mean, for he he does, he does not practice like a freshman. So uh, really excited for him. You know, at practice the past couple of days, Raji has been out there cheering everybody on. Yeah. Um, how important has that been to the team? It's been good. You know, and I, I mean, he stopped by and saw me today before meetings and stuff. And, you know, he's the same self. And I know he's, you know, he's, uh, you know, not looking forward to, you know, what he's got to go through. But uh, he's kept a very positive vibe. And I, I really appreciate the way kind of um, Pirate Nation's rallied around him. And uh, I think that shows, number one, uh, just how great our fan base is. But I think number two, it shows just how, how attached everybody is to him and his personality. Um, so, like I said, you know, he's going to continue to contribute to our program. It'll just be in a different uh, capacity moving forward. What can you draw on from, I guess, the previous week on a road game, moving into another road game? Like, how do you kind of bring that same energy in? Well, I mean, I, I think that it'll be a different setting uh, in that, you know, it's going to be probably a pretty – Pretty full stadium. Uh, I would expect that we're going to have a pretty large contingency down there from uh, from our fan base. Uh, but uh, still, I mean, it's a it's a travel game, so I think last week's good, uh, even for the experienced kids. It's their first uh, first road game of the year, so it's been a while since we were on the road. So it kind of got everybody back in the back in the groove. Uh, kickoff is a similar time, uh, so that uh, the morning routine on Saturday will be similar to what it was last week. So I think it's good to have that under our belt. Talking about Marlon, he, he's going back to his home state. You think he's pretty excited about that? Ah, uh, he's excited. So uh, I think he's used up everybody's allotments. So uh, he'll have a bunch of family there, um, and that, that's great. I mean, he's got a great family, and you know his grandparents and uh, mom and dad and everybody. So uh, it'll be it'll be good for him. So, Coach Colton talked about his decision making improved drastically, and obviously the results were there. Uh, did you see that out of him this week uh, in, in the game and then in practice? Well, I think last week in the game, uh, I thought his decision-making was very good. Um, and, you know, we we put a lot on him. I mean, he's, he's very similar to Pratt in that, uh, you know, he's seen about everything. And so um, he'll be prepared. And I'm sure I'm sure Tulane's going to throw some stuff at us we haven't seen. Um, they do a great job of game planning. But, uh, you know, he's seen a lot of stuff. So, um, yeah, I think he'll, he'll be able to handle it. Anything else for Coach? All right. Appreciate Thanks a lot. Thanks, Coach.